Hello and welcome to the Swift tutorial. In this video, I am going to show you how to use the tab bar. So that is when you have an application and you have icons at the bottom and then you can tap the icons in order to get to the, the different view controllers. So if that is something you want to implement in your app and know how to use, then just keep watching this video and I will show you how simple it is to implement. Okay, so let's see how we use the tab bar. And in order for us to do that, we create a new Xcode project. And instead of choosing a single view application, we are going to choose a tabbed application. Click next, and then I'm going to call it tabbed app. Save it on my desktop right there. And if you're watching this tutorial, it's probably because you're creating an app and you want to know how to do this. You want this uh, you want this kind of functionality in your app so I'm just going to show you straight and easy how to do this so that you can um, continue with your app and implement this into your app and uh, so let's take a look at how we use a tab bar so right here you can see it's all set up for us so we have our first view controller which is connected to this view controller file right here and then we have our second view controller, which is connected to the second view controller file right here, where you can write all your code and all that good stuff. And this one just manages all of the view controllers and the tab bar. So let's uh, run the app and just see how everything looks right now. And then afterwards, we're going to try to add or we are going to add another view controller. And I'm going to show you how you can just expand this almost into infinity but uh, let's take a look at the application in its current state and as you see we have our first view controller and we can switch between our first and second view controller all very nice and good but let's try to add another view controller so i'm dragging in this view controller right there and as you can see it's a plain old boring view control now right now it isn't connected but that is actually pretty simple to do we just click on this yellow button and control drag over to our new view controller and we're going to select relationship and uh, segue and it's going to be view controllers and then as you see we added another item in our tab bar and we have our uh, our new view controller all set up so now i can click on this item right here and I'm going to I can select a different item like uh, more and all the other icons that you've probably seen if you're an iPhone or iPad user recent so I'm just going to let it be at that and I'm going to launch the app one more time and then as you will see we now have our third view controller that we now can use and it's all set up with our tab bar so first second and third view controller and everything else is just like a normal view controller so you have your view control here and you have your view controller files right here and you set it up just like a normal application the only difference is that now you have the this nice tab bar where you can switch easily between all the view controls uh, so that's the basics of how to use a tab bar and create your very own tab bar applications if you enjoyed this video make sure that you click the subscribe button so that you stay tuned for future videos and uh, if you do so i'm really looking forward to seeing you in the next video